Hi, I'm Victor and I'm going to show you a workflow for automatically creating wall finishes in Revit using Dynamo. So what it does, uh, it looks up uh, certain rooms and uh, for example all the rooms uh, containing bat in it, their names and then it's uh, looking up for the finished materials of the surrounding walls. So if this is the room uh, the Dynamo definition uh, is searching and comparing the materials of uh, the walls which are touching the room. So this material right here. Um, for example, if I select this wall, its finished material is uh, ivory mat so and this is the finish here and this wall has gypsum wall board as finished material so in dynamo I'm telling it right here to search all the walls with the finish of gypsum wall board and all the rooms containing bat in their names. So, what else? Uh, I'm telling it uh, what kind of uh, finish wall to use. So, right here bathroom finish tabs can delete this and this and I'm telling it the height of the walls so let's just hit run and it's ready so you can see now right here we have an additional wall Yeah, you can see it right here too. This is these are the two bathrooms. If I decide to change now the height, you can put the slider here, but uh, I'll just manually type the height and hit run again. You can see now uh, the wall is. 180 centimeters tall. So you can see because these two walls are not using the same wall finish, they don't have the new wall finish. So if I change. Uh, this room here is going to see another bathroom. We need to run the definition again, but we need to just restart it. This is restarting it because it should uh, it would use uh, the other the other rooms if I don't restart it like this, and then rerun it. Let's see what happens. We have now the additional wall here. Let's see it in 3D. Where is it? Ah, yeah. It's uh, just in this wall because it's the wall containing gypsum wall board. This other wall here is not with the same finishes. So if I just match the properties or to modify and put it that wall and then rerun the definition it should create another finish wall.
but I'm still in command here, so okay. just need to restart it again. Okay, like this, and uh, rerun it. So voila, here it is. We have the additional finish wall. Uh, so if we look at the dynamo definition, this is the launch box room element collector. We are using the rooms, the name, the location of the room is used for offsetting the wall. In the room boundaries, of course. Here, this is a custom uh, Python script uh, which is founding the material of the surrounding walls. And this is it. This is the filtering. We filter the rooms first by name, and then we filter the surrounding materials, and then we create according to walls. So this is just the simplest version of uh, this workflow. It could be used to automatically create different type of wall finishes with different heights depending on the name of the names of the rooms or the surrounding materials or whatever other parameter parameter you want from um, from the room. The room ID if you want the area if you want uh, a certain wall to be created uh, only on the rooms um, with a real greater than n square meters. So this is it. Thank you for your attention. Bye bye.